What is going on guys welcome back to another video of chat application development series in android studio. In last video we have implemented this profile fragment and we have updated the username also we have implemented this logout. In this video we will implement the profile picture feature. First thing we will do we will take the profile picture from the android device set it to image view and when we click on update it will store it in the firebase storage. So first thing we have to get the image from the device. So for that I will use some library. Let's go to Google and search for image picker android library. As you can see we have this dhawal2404. You can click on this github package and we will use this package. So first thing we have to add this maven url jetpack io. So copy this. Go to our project. Go to settings.gradle and here in dependency resolution management we have google and maven central below this we will add this maven click on sync now it will download the required packages now we have to go and copy this implementation that is dependency copy this go to build.gradle and paste it over here click on sync now it has downloaded the required package we can close it close this also close this login username activity also now on click of that image view we will take the image from the user so for that we have to set activity result launcher previously we used to use on activity result but that is deprecated now so we will use activity result launcher so here i will create a object of activity result launcher type will be intent and it will we will say image pick launcher so this is the object we are going to create and in onCreate method we have to initialize this. So after this I will override onCreate method. If you write on it will suggest onCreate. Here I will initialize it image pick launcher equals to register for activity result where we have to pass new activity result contracts dot start activity for result. Click on it. Second parameter we have to send just go down over here and see so if you see over here first thing is contract and second thing is callback method so in second we will get the result so result we will use lambda we can keep semicolon over here and in result we will check if result dot get result code equals to equals to activity dot result ok if we get the result that means image has been selected we will use intent data equals to result dot get data we will get this data if data is not equal to null and and data dot get data that will give the image uri is not equal to null if it is not null we need to get that data in a uri so we need the uri so here what we will do uri selected image uri import it import the uri so this selected image uri will be the image selected by user that means data dot get data so in this selected image uri we will get the uri of the image from the user now we have to launch this image pick launcher we have just initialized everything but we have not launched this launcher so to launch this launcher what we will do we will set on click on the profile picture so here after logout we will set profile pick dot set on click listener here we will launch that so how we will launch that we will here use the library so that library we have imported so we, we have a class image picker dot with pass the fragment dot we need to crop the square we need to compress it it won't be big size let's say 5 to 12 dot max result size we'll set it to 5 to 12 by 5 to 12 and we will create the intent so this intent will take new function enter it here you can see invoke method is there so in this invoke method we have to just image pick launcher dot launch pass that intent so that's it in this way we will launch the image picker on click of this profile picture so what it will do it will take the uri and set it to selected image uri till now we have just selected the image uri 
we have not set it to profile picture view that means image view we have to set this uri to the image view so to set that we will use another library that will be glide library the library go to this glide and also copy this implementation code copy it build at gradle paste it over here so sync now it has downloaded the dependency close it now we can directly set the uri to image view from here like glide dot get context and everything i will not do that i will use android util class so that we can use it everywhere i will create a public static i will make a method set profile pic it will return void and it will take three things context context second thing it will be image uri that will be image uri third thing it will take is image view where we want to set the image view so here we will use the glide so glide so glide dot glide dot with context dot load it will load from image uri dot apply so we will require a circle so that's why request options request options dot circle transform circle crop transform dot into target is our image view so that's it this method will set the image uri to the image view so let's go to our profile fragment when we get the selected image uri we just need to call android util dot set profile picture context will be get context image uri will be selected image uri image view will be our profile picture that's it let's run it we are running it emulator 2 so i will go to profile this is iron man so i will click on this gallery i have already downloaded the photos of hulk spider-man and iron man so i will select this photo and we can crop from here so you can use this crop to crop i will crop till this click on ok so as you can see it has set our image to selected image but updating the profile will not update this image view because we have not added anything we have just got the image from android device and set it to image view now when we click on update profile we want to add this image view to our storage so what we will do first go to our firebase and go build over here and click on storage so we need storage features also now so click on get started start in test mode next done so we have created the bucket for our storage now let's go to the project add the dependency for that so if you remember we have added from tools firebase we have added cloud fire store now we will need to add cloud storage so expand it get started just click on this it will add the dependencies now we have added you, you can close this now what we will do we will upload this selected image uri to the firebase storage so when we will do we will do on update button click so let's go to update button click here we are updating to fire store before that before updating any user what we will do we will get the storage reference and add that image uri so we'll go to firebase util public static storage storage reference get current profile pick storage reference firebase storage we were using fire store now we will use firebase storage dot get instance dot get reference dot so we have to create a child that means we have to create a folder over here so folder name will be profile pick we will create the folder name profile pick and inside that we will name the image so name of the image will be user id so that it will be unique so we are doing this firebase util dot get current user dot current user id that's it so inside profile pics folder we have to create the image name with our current user id so that if we update new image also it will replace that now we will go to profile fragment here we will do firebase util dot get current profile picture re storage reference dot put file and file will be selected image uri but before that let's check if it is null or not if user has not selected any image we don't want to do that so if selected image uri is not equal to null cut this put the file so we'll add on complete listener to this so add on complete listener make it lambda 
once it is completed means once profile picture is updated we need to do this update to firestore so we were first we were doing directly but now first we will add the image and then we'll update to firestore but if selected image uri is null that means user has not selected image but just want to update only the username so in that case it will come to else we just need to update to firestore from here also if we have image selected we will first upload the image if we don't have image directly update to the firestore let's run it go to profile i will add image that will be this click on ok so image is added name we don't want to change so just click on update profile it works or not so it is saying updated successfully that means it has updated let's go to the back end reload this console as you can see profile picture folder is created and inside this we have image with the name of user id so if you click on this you can see over here so this is now updated to the firebase if you want to change this also it will update to this user id now we have to show this image everywhere now if you go over here and come back it is not showing the image because we have updated it but we have not setting directly from the firebase storage so if firebase storage has the image it should load in the image view so first we will do go to get user data here we will get the current profile picture also so get user data firebase util dot get current profile picture storage reference dot get download url we will use download url from this we will get the download url so add on complete listener on complete listener replace with lambda so here if task is successful then we will get the uri uri equals to task dot get result we'll get the uri from this and we just want to set it to android util dot set profile picture context will be get context uri will be uri now image view will be profile pic that's it so now while getting the data also we will get the profile picture go to profile as you can see after some second we can see the profile picture over here that means this we are getting from the firebase storage we can click on this and also update the user profile picture so our updating profile picture is working fine but we have only implemented over here if you go and check on emulator 1 i will log in with second user from emulator 1 this user is captain america and we cannot see image over here because we have not implemented on this we have only implemented over here since captain america don't have any image so let's add the image for captain america also I have not run it so let's run it on android emulator 1 so if i go to profile and add image for captain america also i have the image okay update profile so now you can see in profile we have this captain america image if you go in chats you can't see each other image because we have not added over here so let's do that first just we have to copy this code so that this will add the image so just copy this and first we will go to recent chat recycler adapter so in recent chat recycler adapter we have this other user model over here after we get the other user model what we will do we will paste it over here so we have the task variable already so you can you can change the variable name to t you can name it anything and here get context will be context uri will be uri and profile picture will be our view holder dot profile pic so we have added the code but if you see over here we have this current profile picture storage reference if you go to this it will always take the profile picture of the current user so we don't want that we want another user profile picture so what we will do create get other profile picture storage reference where we will pass the id from the method itself so string other user id so instead of this child it will be other user id so in this way i will copy this and in recent chart recycler adapter we want picture of other user so here what i will do i will call this get other profile picture reference and i will pass the other user model dot get user id that's it now run it So if we see over here in the chat of Iron Man, 
image has been changed but it is gray so why it is if you go over here and check on recent chat recycler view inside that we have included this layout that is profile picture view here we have this light gray app tint as a light gray that's why it is coming gray we can remove this we don't want to add any tint let's run it again now if you see image is visible so i'm logged in with captain america here he can see the image of iron man and in profile he can see his image that is captain america if i launch it on emulator 2 here it will show the image of captain america so in recent chat also it is working if you go inside this we have to add over here also and we have to add in search user also if we search for iron you can see over here we don't have any image so we have to add in two place more so let's copy this from here get other profile picture reference we'll copy everything and let's go to search user recycler adapter here also after getting other user model we have other user model over here we can set the profile picture anywhere in between so other user model will be model other than that everything will be same and one more place will be chat activity so in chat activity also we need to load so here we can set it anywhere on on create method after everything is initialized here we can set it get profile picture other user model will be other user we have get it from intent this one context will be this and this image view will be profile pic but we have not added anything over here so let's do that quickly image view image view here image view equals to find view by id r dot id dot id will be profile pic image view now we can pass over here image view now everything should be completed related to image let's run it on both the emulator so we have this profile picture if you go to search and if you go to search and search for iron we can see this click on back go to this and we can see the profile picture in chat screen also as you can see we can see the profile picture on chat screen nice profile pic yours also till now we have done with most of the things we have set the profile also we have profile picture also we have search functionality we have chat screen also so in next video we will implement the firebase notification so we will get the notification when message is received and we can click on it and go to the chat so we will implement that firebase notification in next video so if you enjoyed this video please hit the like button if you have any doubts and queries please comment below i will reply for you don't forget to hit the subscribe button before going see you in the next video bye bye